This is Jerry Hobby with Anything Internet. Last week we looked at Facebook from a user's perspective and from a general perspective. The security risks involved in being on Facebook and can you live without Facebook? Well, the truth is you can't live without Facebook, but the article was meant to also say it's not all good. There's good and bad things with Facebook. I'm just putting those thoughts in your mind. Now this week what I want to really talk about is, as a business person, how do you market and participate in Facebook and other social, social communities to promote your company and to promote your product. The truth is a lot of people out there, even the so-called experts, are just dumping garbage into social media hoping you'll notice it and it'll capture your attention and send you to some web page. But I find it easier to ignore people that are just putting messages out there that seem to be um, like a series of, of ads or a series of unimportant facts. It's not going to make me call you if every two hours I get a message that says, we've got the best product in the world, please check it out here. And every two hours I see that from you. It's just going to make me run away or hide or, you know, whatever, block you somehow. So what you have to do is you have to get into that community. You have to participate. You have to be part of that community. Users today are selective. They get to choose who gets to advertise to them. That's the, the, the benefit of this new technologies that we have, is the users choose. Do I want to hear your ads? Do I want to participate with you? Do I like your product? And that's what the whole thing is about. When you're going to market inside of social communities, you need to establish yourself as a credible expert, a participant in the community, somebody with credibility, somebody that's willing to help, somebody that they like hearing from. Some of those users will interact with you like a friend. Some will just sort of relate to you as somebody they can trust. But if they feel like you're dumping ads on them, they're not interested. But if they feel like that they like you, and, and even if they don't necessarily need your information, but they're not offended by it, then they'll embrace you. So there's a fine line between no advertising whatsoever and advertising in a very subtle way. And another fine line between advertising subtle and advertising aggressive and advertising aggressive and being obnoxious. Depending on your product and your community, you got to figure out exactly where you fit, exactly what level to take in these marketing efforts. And your community feedback is going to be helpful on that. But these are the things that we help you look at and the things that we help you monitor. You're going to need to consider, do you need to have somebody on staff that just does the social work for you? Do you need to outsource that? Is it something you can do part-time or full-time? All of this stuff depends on what is your product, who is your, who is your audience or your consumer, and a whole bunch of other things. And that's what we help with, and that's how we can consult with you. If you contact us at Anything Internet, we'll help you look at all of this stuff and find the right strategy for your business. Facebook is here to stay, and if it's not Facebook, it's something like that. As I said before, it doesn't matter what the community is. Social communities is the new technology, but it's that's the technology that's not going away. It's as important as when they've invented any other thing. It's, it's, it's an absolutely critical way to interact with people. And you need to know how to put your company there, okay? So let us know how we can help. Contact us. Get a free evaluation or a free consultation, whatever it is that you need. I'm Jerry Hobby, and this is Anything Internet.